One of my favorite stories of my own resilience against you is one of my favorites to tell. I'm okay. probably said it on the podcast already. I think there was this game where I was up, up against you like three times, which to even hit against you three times in a lineup is like very rare. Um, but I remember the first time I hit off of you and you probably have like no idea, but you could see it on my face. I was just terrified. I was like, holy crap. I watched you play at Tennessee and now we're in the pro league and I'm like up against, how does this work? And even the dugout's like, oh, Monica's on the mound. And I'm sitting here like, what does that mean? Like, I don't, I don't understand. So I was just like shaking in my boots before I walk into that box. Like probably most people that see you for the first time. And you've probably read right through me. I think you threw three fastballs right down the middle. Didn't even touch one. Um, and I sat like the very first time and I was like, okay, well, I'm supposed to hit two more times today. And like, that's not going to happen again. Like, it was just like, I needed that slap in the face. Um, because you do like you pitch, I swear your foot goes outside the circle. <laughs> I swear, like from act- my perspective, I'm like, she is throwing she- her foot is landing outside the circle. And I'm a lefty that normally stands in the middle of the box. Okay. We're gonna have to make some adjustments. So it was like my second at bat that day. No one's hitting off of you that day. I think maybe Kaylin Castillo maybe had like a single, um, but I go back up there and I'm like, okay, well, worst case scenario happened. I struck out in three. My goal is to just touch you. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm literally like a professional athlete, so like sitting here, like, I'm just going to try to touch her and like, see what happens. So my mission, like in the box, I was like, all right, just touch her, just touch her. And I saw a ball go by and I was like, oh my God, this is great. I can actually see it. Um, <laughs> This is literally what's going on in my head. And I really want people to know this because I mean, I'm a professional athlete still trying to keep it simple here. Mm -hmm. Um, And I remember I like popped up to the third baseman and of course I'm out, but I was like, I did what I said I was going to do. Like I touched her, you know, and this is literally me. Uh, And then I had like one more shot that game and I'm like, okay, well, obviously I struck out in three. I'm finally touching her. What's better than a pop-up? Okay. Let's go for like a hard ground ball. And you made that, you made that at bat so hard. I think I remember I watched another ball, but then you threw me this curve ball in my hands and your curve ball, it's like coming to hit me. And then it's going to be a strike. <laughs> so I literally, I was just like, okay, just attack it. Let's hit a hard ground ball. And I hit like the hardest ground ball I've ever hit in my life to the second baseman. And of course, like she gets me out, but internally I'm like, I did it. I did it. Like, I, I, did did it. it. <laughs> I did it. I did it. I did it. I like find, found a way. Um, you know, I love that. I mean, it's so important, but I just think like, it's cool, you know, like those, those internal battles, like between pitchers and hitters are just, they're so fun. Like they are so fun. I live for them and you know, it, it's fun and it's fun to see like adjustments that people make and then trying to like figure out the puzzle of how to get them out. Um, yeah. It's like a chess yeah, match. It's cool. Yeah, it's totally. Like, yeah. It's a chess match. It's like a mask, uh, amazing picture. And then just like, yeah, I don't know. It's just fun to see like people grow. And then also like, you know, I don't know. It's just like so, softball, softball is so fun. It is. <laughs> so fun. That's why it's our living. That's why it's our life. Yeah. yeah. 